In Hagerstown, where a mother has been charged in connection with the death of her two-month-old daughter, WHAG's Rose Lee joins us now live in the studio with more. Rose? That's right, Don. 22-year-old Yadina Indira Morales has been arrested for allegedly causing the death of her daughter after responders found the infant unconscious under Morales' body Saturday morning. And police say she was intoxicated when it happened. Today, I spoke with the Washington County Sheriff's Department and neighbors to find out what really happened that morning. It all happened in this townhome behind me in the Valley Meadows townhomes neighborhood. Police say when they arrived, they found a two-month-old baby girl unresponsive under her mother's body. They say when deputies first arrived, the mother was still unconscious and also highly intoxicated. 22-year-old Yadina Indira Morales was arrested Saturday evening just hours after her infant was pronounced dead at Meredith Medical Center. When we found that the uh, mother was highly intoxicated and had actually been breastfeeding the child and uh, passed out and ultimately smothered the uh, child. Police say Morales was also taken to the medical center as a precaution because of her intoxication level. She has been charged with two felonies, one count of manslaughter and one count of second degree child abuse, along with three other misdemeanors. People in this neighborhood say they're saddened by what has happened. I think it's very tragic that things like this even have to happen. There is just very, very tragic, very sad, very sad. Others say they are shocked. It's, it's crazy. It's just insane how people can drink and, you know, you shouldn't breastfeed your child while you're drunk. We found that Morales has a past criminal record, including arrests for theft and second degree assault. Police say Morales was taken to the Washington County Detention Center, but is out on $100,000 bond. Now, Sheriff Mullender told me there were two other children in the house, age one and three, when they responded Saturday. Police say they are currently being handled by social services. And I was able to speak with the suspect's father, who didn't want to go on camera, but he did tell me they don't know where Morales' other two children are at this time. He also said the family is mourning and that Morales did not mean for her daughter to die. Live in the studio, Rose Lee, WHAG News.